Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jess. Today's video is another moving to New Zealand update video. It is seven weeks until we go and I know I say this in every video, but it's so crazy. It's so weird how simultaneously it feels like it's so close, like seven weeks away. But at the same time, it's kind of like, oh, it's seven weeks away. We still have time to do things and all I know is just trying to take it week by week but it is definitely getting closer. I am sitting here with my coffee which if you're a mama this has been in my yeti mug for a few hours and luckily it's still warm but just with everything going on haven't had enough time to drink it. But I was sitting here and just thought I would post a little bit of an update video. The biggest news that happened this past week is that my registration to practice as a speech language pathologist in New Zealand was finally approved. So I am registered now, which is exciting. can start applying for jobs and put that on my resume and all that good stuff. But it's definitely nice that that's done. It was a lot of paperwork, a lot of signatures, a lot of people writing me letters and we had to send it to New Zealand so it got there safely and it's just nice that that process is done. Um, but that's the big thing that has happened and something that is very exciting. So of course one step closer, check off the box, um, moving to New Zealand. We've sold a couple more big furniture pieces. We have some more furniture pieces that are being claimed by family members. <laughs> it's literally like we'll see them and then we'll be like, hey, do you want this? Do you want this? And then we make mental notes that, hey, this this is going to go to this person. This is going to go to this person. And yeah, we've been putting things on Facebook Marketplace still, so that is still moving and, and going along. Our goals, upcoming goals, we are thinking um, because now that my son is old enough to have his own plane ticket, we get to bring, um, he gets a checked bag, which is nice, more space to, to carry things and bring things over, but we don't actually have as many suitcases and luggage that we need to go over there so a big thing that we will be focusing on now is just going to the thrift store and trying to find some decent luggage can't really borrow luggage from people here because they won't be getting it back for a while and luggage is so expensive so we are thinking we will go to the thrift store and see what they have and just buy some cheap luggage pieces that we can bring along with us. Just trying to think what else has been happening. It all just feels like a blur. My husband has started looking at jobs in New Zealand and writing resumes and I wrote a resignation letter which is just bonkers that that is coming up soon where I'm leaving my job and it's so bittersweet like so excited for new beginnings but also kind of sad to be closing chapters in our life and it's come up a little bit my husband and I were talking about this the other day for example I was sitting in church the other week and they were talking about um, all the things that are coming up in the next few months and I just had this thought where I'm like oh I'm not going to be here for that. You know, I only have so much time left here and it's, yeah, I'm still trying to wrap my head around it all. <laughs> anyway, something else that I'm going to throw into the end of this video is I made a vision board. I was inspired by my sister, actually. She made one and then that afternoon I decided to do one as well and I've never really made a vision board before but I feel like there's a lot happening this year and a lot that I would you know starting afresh there's just something so nice about it you know starting again and creating routines and habits from scratch and it's nice to have those goals in mind when you start so you know where you're aiming where you're going for so i decided to make a vision board and i will show you um in a second and maybe go into a little bit of detail about a couple of things 
But the last thing that I want to say is something really exciting that is coming up in a couple of weeks is I'm actually going to Ottawa. I know, I have a big move coming up and I am going to the other side of Canada. <laughs> it was honestly um, just a spur of the moment decision. My friend recently moved to Ottawa and my parents have some plane credits that need to be used up. So I thought I'm going to do a really quick trip, literally like a three three day trip to Ottawa to see her before I move to New Zealand. So maybe I will film a little bit of that, but very excited to go somewhere. My husband who's lived in Canada his whole life has never even been to Ottawa. So that's something that I get to do for the first time. So super exciting. But I am going to quickly show you my vision board. So this is a quick overview of my vision board. I will highlight a couple of areas. So this one here, um, well firstly, moving to New Zealand, living on a farm, seeing the mountains and the cows, I think that would be really awesome. And to go along with that, I want to learn how to start gardening. So I thought it'd be fun to bring my son um, into gardening and learning myself and showing him and learning new skills. I think that would be really special, really good quality time and a good bonding experience. There's this little house and I love the tire swing on the tree, but I just dream of kind of going along with the farmhouse, uh, going along with the farm, sorry, living in a farmhouse and just having all this space and areas and backyard for my kids to play and more date nights with my husband, being a good mom for my son. And I love this one. This is actually a random picture I found, but of a New Zealand beach, just exploring more of New Zealand. So that's a brief overview of my vision board. Thank you so much for watching this update video. I I'm glad that I am documenting this journey and everything that happens week by week and how I'm feeling. It's going to be good. I say that in every video, but it's going to be good. <laughs> um, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to follow along my journey and like this video. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.